Today, I am talking about a pioneer in black history known for protecting stagecoaches out west and making thieves tremble. Stay tuned for more as I share interesting facts from the biography of Mary Fields, also known as Stagecoach Mary. Beginning with fact number one, the life of Mary Fields began circa 1832. Because Mary was born into slavery, her exact birth date is unknown. Although not much is known about her early days, after Mary gained her freedom once the Civil War ended, she made her way up north, working on riverboats and acting as a servant and laundress for families along the way. Up next, Mary Fields would head to a place of faith. That is where she settled in Ohio, working as a groundskeeper at a local convent in Toledo, Ohio. Checking out this next fact, Mary had a strong personality. Many historians point to Mary's taking pride in her work, often getting upset with anyone who messed up her lawn. Fields would make friends with a nun that would eventually lead her out west. After finding out her friend, Mother Amadeus Dunn, became ill, she traveled to Montana and nursed Dunn back to health. Sadly, her stay at the convent was cut short. That's because her lifestyle raised serious concerns from the bishop about her drinking, smoking, shooting guns, and wearing men's clothing. But what seemed all bad ended up all good for Mary. From there in 1895, Mary became a star carrier, protecting the mail on her route. She was the first African-American woman to serve in that role. Her reputation grew quickly as she met trains with mail, driving off in her stagecoach through rough territory, gaining the nickname Stagecoach Mary. The crazy part about Mary is although she was tough, she had a big heart. Terrifying thieves with her demeanor and size was a part of her job, but she was also praised for her kindness and generosity to children. Mary would go on to be great at what she did. Traveling up and down dangerous grounds, Mary continued on for eight years before she finally retired, riding off into the sunset on her stagecoach. And I hope you enjoyed another amazing story from Black History about Stagecoach Mary. For more interesting stories like this, check out the video we have here on the screen for you coming up. And don't forget to subscribe to Fressburg Cartoon.